hey guys it's z here back with another tutorial i hope you all are doing great so in today's tutorial i'll be teaching you guys my manga color correction that i use in my edits so for this uh, what you need to do is open your CapCut and then just complete your edit then import it and now what you have to do is go to adjustment then make its temperature between minus 20 to minus 15 then change its exposure between minus 5 to minus 10 and make contrast exactly 10 then make shadow between minus 30 to minus 24 and white uh, should be exactly 15 and now you don't have to change anything from here if you want to add vignette then we'll add it later on not now for now what you have to do is add this overlay I'll upload it on my discord server you will get it on my discord server so make sure to join it I'll provide the link in the description what you have to do is add this overlay then rotate it and make its size uh, a bit big just like me and now what you have to do is go to blend and make it overlay drag it a little bit down like the bottom should not be too much dark and now your CC should look something like this and now for the glow what you have to do is go to effects then add this effect called luminance make its filter 0 and rotation between 40 to 25 now it depends upon your video like if you want it to be more glowy then make it strength 40 but I'll do between 25 to 30 it will look good then you have to add another effect called chromation quirk add it to the timeline then make the upper ones value 55 and now you have finally made the CC here you have it now if you want to add vignette for that what you have to do in CapCut PC just compound clip and pre-process it and then just add it but in mobile what you have to do is export it then import it again then add it okay 